Hey everyone, it's Goats. Welcome back. I went ahead and got myself back to the basement. I put some stuff away. I put the metal object back on the door like I had before I died. And now... We can use this elevator. I have the ammo disc on me. I put down the shotgun for now. If I can find more shells, though, I will definitely use them. Then we come across a storage bin. Quick and spooky elevator. Okay, where are we now? Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Too slow for me. Couple of herbs. There's a moth on the window. That's eerie. Oriental scroll on the wall, but the picture on it is Western style. Where's this guy? I think he's down. I think we're okay. The knob is broken, it doesn't look like it'll open. Uh, this is on the other side of the... Oh, I can go that way. Okay, dealt with him. This is on the other side of that door in the library, is what I was gonna say. And it's blocked. But I can get in here. And would you look at that? Shotgun shells, nice. And magnum bullets. Well, I'm glad I made the space for those. Flash grenade, can't go wrong. And a battery. Shelf is full of dust covered props and a deer trophy. Okay. Now that we have the battery, I think we can use that very far from here. I do kind of want to go back downstairs now and get those other shells, because then I'd have a dozen, and that would be worth keeping. Oh, this is the door I just went through. I thought this might have been the other way out. Oh, that's up here. Yeah, this is the door. You unlocked it. Another shortcut to where? This hallway. Which is... Close to the item box. What a weird... What was that guy's name? Uh, Trevor? George Trevor? I want to double check. Trevor's diary. What was his name? I think he signed it at the end. George Trevor, yeah. So he said he was the one that designed this place? Well, he's an idiot, if you ask me. Is this the door? Yes. I don't know who would have commissioned a house like this to live in. Like, even if he planned to do evil shit, it's just such a convoluted, mazy mansion. Okay, we'll put magnum rounds together. Take the shotgun back. 
put these pistol bullets back. Put the knife there. I'll put the fuel canteen like up here, I guess. Keep the battery. Keep the shells. Gonna reload them. Uh, I'll keep the ammo disc. Actually, I could make an argument for taking the Magnum, because it actually has more bullets than the shotgun right now. And I am going to do that. I got a lot of shots with this thing, and it's probably going to kill stuff real quick. Now I have to take the battery... Well, first of all, I'm going to have to get back to the other item box, basically, because I think I have to get to the courtyard. And somewhere in the courtyard I can use the battery. Or was it the... No, it wasn't the residence. Definitely the courtyard. But I'm going to save while I'm here. Uh, actually, no, I'm not. No, I'm not. I'm gonna be fine. I just have to make it back to the other safe room again. And the fastest way to do that now is the same way as before. Through here. I think one of those frog mutant things busted down this door over here. Yeah, so I can just whoop, walk right through it. That's kind of nice. I gotta go through here. The rest of the way is pretty straightforward at this point. Although I've kind of said that every time. And I've always had to check the map. This time I actually don't. don't have to check the map. Yeah, like what? Like this kind of door? It's just weird. And I gotta go through here. Crows are still mad, but they're okay with my choice of lighting. Hello, Mr. Bird. Okay, this guy's still here. Get rid of him real quick. And this door is not locked. I don't even think I need to go in there. That would be the way to... the safe room. But I don't really think I need to save at the moment. I mean, I've got a magnum on me. Got the ammo disc. Oh shit, this isn't where I need to be, is it? Oh, it is. It is where I need to be, which means I need the metal object that I left on the door. Of course. Totally forgot that that was related to the courtyard. I thought we were done with it. Unbelievable. Quite believable, actually, that I would leave a bunch of junk behind that turns out to be vitally important to the progression of the game. But that's okay. That's what this game is all about. Inventory management and backtracking.
Yes, I will take the stone and metal object. Thank you. And now that I have it, I can put it in the thing to unlock the courtyard door. And there's a safe room over there, which is good, because I think I'm also going to need the crank. Now that I've had so much spare time to plan ahead, I'm pretty sure how this is going to go down. Uh, I'm going to put the battery in the thing, take the elevator, and that's going to give me access to a new way around the courtyard so I can use the crank to shut off that dam uh, that's causing the waterfall to go over that cave and I need to go in that cave. That's my best guess. Now I can go through here. And do I need to go straight out of this door or... Pretty sure I do. I'm pretty sure going the other way leads to the shack with that weird creature in it. I dealt with the dogs. Uh, which way do I need to go? This way. I think. Nope. Not yet. Which way did I come from? Not up here. Or did I come from up here? No, this is where I need the crank. But first I have to get to the other side and fix the elevator. Right. I hope that's right. I hope I don't have to deal with the snakes. Ah, shit. Fine. No poison. Okay, dodge those ones. Yeah, dodge all these snakes. Now, does this elevator take me to... Another outside area. Across from which... Has... A battery... Has been taken out. So I will put a new one in. And take this elevator up. Now I still need the crank. I need it pretty badly, actually. Where is... I really don't want to go all the way back there. So I guess back to the crank it is then. Because I'm obviously going to have to reverse that water. Whatever I did to it before. I think I just lowered some sort of gate. I'll have to raise it again. And I can go under the waterfall. And I bet there's going to be something totally ridiculously out of place under there, like... Oh, this is obviously where the computer is. You're going to need the MO disk. Now that you've gotten under the waterfall, that's where we decided to store our computer. in a cave, in the courtyard. 
like some kind of fools. Uh, crank is where? It's up here? Crank? Alright, that better be the only thing I need. Or I'm gonna lose my mind. Uh, the doorknob has been repaired, I know. Just go through it. Just gotta admire Wesker's handiwork once in a while. Heading on back. Do, 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 heading on back. Tried to do a cool spin there, but it ended up just messing with the camera. Whoops. Alright, crank. I'm about to crank you. Like you've never been cranked before. So now that the elevator's on this level, I should be able to fill this zone up with the crank. Nice crank and Chris. sound of the waterfall seems to have stopped. Perfect. Now I gotta head back to the new elevator. The newly battery powered electric elevator. Very forward thinking. for a seemingly ancient house. Yeah, there we go. This is where it was overflowing to. Anything in here want to get a magnum round to the face? I got enough for a couple people. Okay, where am I now? Courtyard B1. Typewriter item box? Really? Right over here. Wouldn't you know it. Oh, I'll put this back. And I'll pick up these ribbons. Why not? And I'll use one. So now, somewhere down here, we're going to have to use maybe those eagle and wolf emblems? So what am I looking at this way? Hexa hexagonal hole. Can't go that way yet. I guess we have to raise the bridge or something. But there's a door here that we can go through. Oh shit, I didn't put the ribbons away. And I think I might. I'm gonna go back and quickly do that because if this is a big zone, I might need to pick up two items. Uh, I'll pick up this blue herb too because I'm already on my way back to the box. I might have a red and green that need a good old blue? I do. In that case, I will stack these ribbons with the others. Take the green, take the red. Combine them. And 
that in here. Let's get these kind of organized so they're all together. And that's that. All right. A nice bonus herb out of that. Back through the door. We'll say that this is the first time. What do we got? Big scary room. This side's a dead end. But it's actually shells. This side has a door. And I wonder if we're gonna have to deal with the the thing in the chains that can't be killed by guns, like Wesker said. What are we looking at here? Big old room. Kinda spooky. That's handgun ammo on the ground. A huge gaping hole, wonder what it was dug for. Yeah. Not really sure how much I do wonder that. Ignorance, in this case, maybe just so euphorically blissful. But I'd almost like to keep it that way. Here we go. Enrico, don't what? come any closer, Chris. What happened? Double crosser. Enrico, wait. <laughs> Enrico! Um, well. Uh... Enrico! Double crosser. Well, Enrico. Killed him with just one shot. Who could it be? I have a feeling it was Wesker. I'll take the crank. Enrico is dead. What could he have known? Too much, obviously. Now we have to run all the way... <laughs> all the way back through the tunnels. Blast a couple dudes on the way, is what I was gonna say. We're probably gonna have to do that. Oh, what's this on the ground over here? I think it's more handgun ammo? It is, but I'll take it because I have to go past... ...the box anyway, once more. It's a green herb, don't need it. I will pick up this handgun ammo. Might as well. I don't even think I need it. I doubt I'm gonna even ever use the handgun again. Since I've got this lovely magnum. And it just seems to slaughter these guys, which I'm very pleased about. times with the super gun. Yep, need to go this way. Better not be one of those creepy things over here. Let's put those in there. Put the shells in here. Put the others. I need the crank. I still think the ammo disc is going to come in handy at some point. not necessary to use. I disagree. Maybe I just need to be... Yeah, I was just not facing it 100% perfectly. What the fuck? That has got to be the most ridiculous thing that I've seen so far in this game, to be honest. What the f 
fuck is that thing? Flamethrower? Hell yeah. Uh oh. Ah, I wonder if because I took it, something's gonna be angry at me. A huge boulder blocks the way. Fuck. I saw that coming. Nice try, Rock, but I am smarter than you. Just some shells back here, hey? Is that really it? Oh no, there's another way to go over here. I think I might go back and put the crank and the shells away. Oh no, the door's locked and won't open. Ah, probably because I can't take this with me. Yep, that seems to be the case. I can live with that. Let's put the flame, or not the flame, throw the crank in here with the other crank. shells. I'm liking having the magnum. It's a lot of fun, and I got a lot of shots left. So I'm gonna keep using it. Oh, oh come on, man. Come on. Didn't I already deal with y'all? Still got a swipe on me. What is this? A giant spoiler! Take that! Take one of these! Take one of those! Ooh, don't touch me! Boom! That'll do it. Oh, there's another one. Boom! Haha! <laughs> I'm gonna step on the tiny ones. Oh shit, is it not dead? They're kinda twitching. Can I see a map of this room? There's another one up on the roof, hey? Ooh, survival knife. That might be nice. Oh shit, gotta reload. One sec. Fuck. I don't like missing with this gun. Oh my goodness, this one's like... Too quick for me, I guess. Huge spiderweb blocks the door. I bet, if I use the knife... Yeah. I thought it was kind of weird that they just gave me a knife in here. Okay, don't have any extra shots left for this bad boy. I have to make him count. Oh, you know what? Hang on a sec. I didn't even pick up the fucking flamethrower. That probably would have made these guys a piece of cake. Well, I'm gonna go back and get it, because I would definitely like to throw some flames. I'll take it. That just locks that door, so I can't continue unless I put it back. That's fine. Everything seems to be permanently dead in there. Alright. Now let's see what we got in here.